Yo, what is up? You do what you want to heed. Back to watch more Stargate SG-1 here to watch Season 4, Episode 3, if I believe so. Continuing along. So excited to be here. Thank you all for watching me. I appreciate you. I love you. You guys know all the announcements. Comment, like, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications, uncut early access. This will be available on Patreon YouTube memberships. Let's do this bad boy. Stargate, Stargate, Stargate is the one to say, man. <laughs> Ooh, Toker so transmission. That every time they show up, it seems like there's all kinds of. Okay, who are you? She looks. She looks familiar. Who is it? The High Council. Toker oh, okay. You may call me Anise. Okay, I was like, she's new. I'm Jack. It means. What's in the box? Yeah, what's in the box? Many thought it was just a myth. Still, the Gold and the Tokra have both sought these devices for some time. Okay. Obviously not a myth. Not a myth, so. The Tokra were very excited when I found them. They don't work for you. They work for pro Our top scientific minds have researched the technology. They probably work for humans. Then the device will most likely be ineffective on me as well. Yes. Which is why I brought... Oh, shit. They're about to be superheroes? Incredible speed and strength. Why the fuck In not? all of your natural abilities. That's... Fuck it. Kind of Major Carter and Dr. Jackson. I had hoped to begin human trial experiments immediately. Ex what is your answer? It's gonna be a yes, probably, bro. Fuck. You ain't want nobody else to go check out the shit out. I use the bathroom. We'll go right back. This is a Tokra biosensor. It will monitor every aspect of your <laughs> physiological condition. <coughs> She's fine. We give you a chance to adapt to your new abilities. In the meantime, feel free to move around and interact with your environment as you normally would. The biosensor will transmit readings over significant distance. Okay. All right. I'd go to the gym and start cranking some shit out. I'd be like, let's go, let's go. Oh shit, never mind. That's, uh, I thought that was Daniel, but that's O'Neill. Holy shit, that was sick. Oh, wow. Damn, that knocked him out, bro. So you feeling any better? Or will be fine, Dr. Frazier. Kill. You fucking swung at him. Sorry. You're not. He's <laughs> right about that. He got his ass beat every time, probably. <laughs> this is great. Strength is five times that of a normal human. So... No increase in it. Oh, jeez. Is he able to be smarter than he originally is with that thing? Or is this a physical situation? Okay, never mind. I guess you are just, you can gain information a lot quicker now. There's, there has to be something bad that, has, that happens about it. They can't, this, this can't be all that good. It's a um, little dark, don't you think? Is it? Oh, wow, she can see better now. How? Wow. Affecting, uh, does it affect different parts? Like, is it, no, this is the same thing. Anise is monitoring our vitals. Yes, I know. You don't trust her biosensors? You don't trust her. So you don't trust her? I'd like to run a full blood screen. Listen to the doc. Listen to the one that you trust. Yeah, she is fantastic. What's her name? Is her name Vanessa Angel? Nothing, but the, you, see, you see, the point is, I can read really fast. A notebook? My host Freya enjoys the tactile sensation of handwriting. The inscription says, with great power comes great responsibility oh god to is that namaste right you know what dude uncle ben you haven't speculated spider man why the acne became extinct no my primary concern up in anise can i see it for a moment oh we'll see what this doc has to say major carter's blood work showed a dangerous amount of adrenaline in her system i object to being kept in the dark about the condition of people whose health i am responsible for are you suggesting i would risk their health Yes. Dr. Werner? I think the armbands may be having a narcotic-like effect. Wearing them may become addictive. It's just one of the things that I would like to rule out. Having a hard time complying. Mm. 
What does that mean? Right, I'm a little worried now. I'll be a little worried now. I'm a little worried. We've tried every we'll hold that option in reserve. You must admit the positive effect is astonishing. This as long as there's no downside. Ew. Hammond about that. I mean, we should be using these things. Jeez. You type so fast that that computer is still typing. I'm writing a book on wormhole physics, but this damn computer isn't fast enough. When the buffer's full, I have to wait for it to catch up. Absolutely not. Oh, come on, General. Why do we put these things on in the first place? We still aren't sure what the long-term effects will be. I mean, look at this. <laughs> well, you might be right about that. It's just so damn exciting, sir. I'm sure it is. Yeah, dude, and there's something... Just get the hell out of my office. Damn. I think he's starting to maybe feel on me. Hey, Silas. No, no, no. That was not good. That guy, that guy could have died. Red, juicy meat. O'Malley's in town. Let's go. They're not allowed to leave. Let's eat. This is insane. Okay. I kind of wanted to see them in a nice little setting. Three of the biggest steaks you've got with everything. Rare. Baked potato. Got it. Rare. Excuse me. That was for me. Four is good. Yeah. Me too. And french fries with mine. Oh, and a uh, diet soda. Jeez. I like the taste better. <laughs> He's drinking too. This is not a good combination. Well, it's not like we haven't defied orders before. Oh well, my God, it's coming from Daniel. Earth. Earth, steaks. There's a difference. We'll look back before anyone knows we're gone. Yeah, right. Well, they all know that you're gone. How the hell did you do that? Wanna go double or nothing? No, I think I'll cut my losses. Smart move. What are you laughing at, you geek? Uh-oh, guys, don't, don't do this. Geek. Don't, guys. This is gonna be bad. This is gonna be bad. Team SG gone bad. Go. What are you gonna do? Oh, man, this scenario. <laughs> this is like in almost every movie, I feel like, or every TV show. Well. Oh god, he called it! This is a cliche! <laughs> Poor O'Malley's. They were just a good place to have steaks. And they just fucked it all up. Blood tests show early indication of multiple organ failure. The human body wasn't meant to be put through this. There's no magic pill that'll combat a virus, but there are a few treatments we can try. But that's no guarantee. The toker just came and fucked up Team SG. She's such a smart cookie, I love her. Can you explain to me why <coughs> several witnesses put you people at a restaurant in town last night? The report says there was a brawl. More of a scuffle, so. You're lucky you didn't kill any of those men. No, we were very careful about that, General. <laughs> What am I supposed to do with you people? To forward the idea of putting SG-1's new skills into practical use. Yes! Sir. <laughs> Class of battleship that Apophis is building. Just received. Our internal attempt at sabotage has already failed. However, based on our intelligence, a special covert team could... You've known all along. Oh, God. This was... I've been at this a long time. And I know damn well when I'm being. This is my guy. I realize how this must look. Right now, I don't think the Tokra have my people's best interest. <coughs> in General, I'm sure the High Council will be disappointed. I have downloaded everything we know about the battleship's construction. How long is this fucking episode, dog? Yeah. 
he's angry as fuck. I would be too, bro. They completely just use them, bro. What a manipulation. So you think we have a problem here? This new vessel has several advancements over the global motherships we had previously engaged in battle. We must stop its completion. I can't send the rest of SG-1 on such a dangerous mission knowing their judgment is impaired. <laughs> He's gonna have to be the one to rate a man I'm with this. I can go alone then. Gould force shields operate on a frequency oscillation principle. If we were moving fast enough, theoretically, we should be able to see the oscillation interval and run right through. That's pretty sick. They're like fucking, they're like Flash. We'll need snacks. Oh, oh god, they're going. Oh wow, they're going. I need to go out that, with that teal. Damn. They just said, fuck it, let's go. I wonder how quick this is gonna be. They're gonna fuck them all up. Like that, dude. This is kinda sick. This is kind of sick. <laughs> this is really sick, actually. <laughs> this is in and out, bro. This is like what would happen if superheroes existed in their world, you know? <laughs> this is kind of fantastic. Really fantastic. <laughs> Definitely having fun with this episode. This is great. Force shield should be somewhere around here. The effects are going to be taken. Jeez. In and out. Actually, this is, uh, this is getting kind of heavy. Yeah, dude, they're getting weak. Oh, wow, I came off them? What's going on? How so? The armbands only work for a limited time, sir. Once the immunity spread among the Athenic warriors, the armbands would be useless. It's likely out there on a planet full of heavily armed fall with an advantage that could disappear at any time. Yes. That's terrible. He's pissed. General, <coughs> it's worth a nice and I are sorry. I do hope SG-1 returns safely. They, me too, bro. <laughs> Who shot them? Of course. Seems my assistant of course. Control. Of course. Of course. Yes. Who else? Oh, she couldn't make it. Maybe he can carry her through it. No. That's bad. That's fucking terrible. Fuck. Sir. Did she do it away like that? Colonel? She brought more snacks. Yeah. There is no way in there to help them. No. Fuck. What's going on, man? It's three episodes in, what the fuck's the plan? Yeah, they ain't leaving the fan behind. So the fact that we're staying is based on our complete. What an episode, man. We went from having superpowers to invading an Apophis' ship. Fuck. Did you see that? Let's, Let's go. go. You gotta go. I don't get that limit. I would have taken it. Come on, let's go. Move, 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 move. move. I thought I told you guys to get back to that gate. Yeah, Teal wouldn't leave. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Teal got that shot, boy. Man, what episode? For real. <laughs> Knock that motherfucker out. Uh, 
The shit is gone. This was a really fun episode. <laughs> we had steak dinners to superpowers to fucking build, blowing up Apophis' ship. I'm with it. What a fantastic episode. And we got to see her. She's... Oh, wow. We'll be. I am very well, General. <laughs> what happened? How about the obviously impending court martials? I'd like... We're all under the influence of an alien technology, Colonel. That's a pretty solid defense. <laughs> Even so, I... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Me too. Me three. <laughs> I don't need to apologize. <laughs> Tilt was actually following orders. <laughs> <laughs> of course it was. Okay. Okay. Anise and I both hope we can work together again in the future. Both of you? Can't wait for that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I want to see more of her. Yeah, she's fat. She's gorgeous. All right, y'all. Really good episode. That was a really fun episode. I mean, just to top it off, like, we had so much adventure in, in this one. Like, for real. Like, uh, from, uh, you know, the beginning to this, the whole ending, it was, like, nonstop, I feel like. You know, we get introduced with this new, the Atonique's power, whatever the fuck, the armband. It makes these guys basically become superhuman. They're like, they're like a combination of Superman and the Flash. Like, super, like, just superhuman. They can read fast. They can do everything. Uh, that was really cool to see all of them kind of like venture into their own strengths. Like, you know, obviously Colonel O'Neill was on the physical, uh, you know, Carter and uh, Daniel, they focus in on their academics. One wrote a book and one kept read reading books. That was impressive. Uh, they all had steak dinners and we got to see them out and about, which we barely ever see. They were at O'Malley's and caused a bar fight. And there was a bar fight in this episode. I wish we would have seen more of the bar fight. It was a little bit cliche, the bar fight, but even freaking O'Neill called it. That was great. And then they slipped in to go for them to use their abilities on Apophis' ship to take it down, which was just, I think that was the topping, that was the cherry on top. Everything worked out great. They didn't get court-martialed. And we got to see the, the new, a lot of cool stuff. And we got introduced to this new character named Denise, who I think is fantastically good looking. Uh... But yeah, guys, it was this was fantastic. I love this episode. Uh, I wonder what more. I mean, obviously, I think this this will continue on because we got rid of a huge a huge thing for Poppins. So I'm sure he's gonna be pissed off about this. I wonder what his uh, what he, he's gonna do to get back at us because he's not gonna sit around and just be okay with this because that was a, a crazy looking ship that they took out. Most of all, fantastic. I loved it. Uh, I just wanna thank you all for watching with me. Like I always say, please take care of yourself, your families. We'll see you on the next one. Peace.